Hello, Artifact. I'm Artifact Mars. Not quite awake yet. Uh, Donald Trump's Walk of Fame star destroyed in Hollywood. You see this for yourself. Vandal took pickaxe to the star and basically destroyed it. Somebody else wrote some graffiti over it. Donald Trump's star in the Walk of Fame in Hollywood has been destroyed. According to LA Times, the LAPD received a call from the man who allegedly took a pickaxe to the president's spot on the strip in Los Angeles. Force claimed the suspect arrived with a guitar case before taking out the implement to destroy the star. While he had fled the scene by the time officers arrived, he has since turned himself in and remains in police custody. So apparently he, he uh, developed a conscience and said, well, this was wrong what I did. But I got some liberals to show you from my own chat group. On t uh, it's a tap -a talk now. And they think it's funny. Honest to God. Source claimed he would probably be charged with felony vandalism. And it goes on and on. So let's take a look at my chat group. These people are twisted in the head. Here's the original post from Potter fans referring to Harry Potter. And we'll show you briefly the article. This is a satire site in the UK. Uh, news Thump. Destruction of Walk of Fame star leads Donald Trump down to the last six or cruxes. It's some stupid thing to do with Harry Potter. I don't know what that. I don't pay any attention, but. Uh, so, this site, News Thump. Who in the UK thinks that uh, this is funny. Apparently. I think this is from the UK. And as much as Harry Potter was the UK, uh, uh, series or movies, whatever. I watched one or two of them. I was bored. Alright, whether they're UK or not, uh, they still think it's funny. I'll show you CFM, Salsa Fairy Mom. This is great. Song Eowyn, Song Weaver. Hey, I love it. BSSM, who lives in Australia. Smiles. So I ripped into him. Well, you like this fact. Four liberals, and probably not the only ones here like the fact that the crime was committed. It's a crime of vandalism. So there's nothing good about people, some people here. And... They go on and on. So here's the replies. Celtic Fairy Mom. I have not once supported vandalism. Nice try. But you just did. That is bullshit. Snake Dancer, no one here is glad a crime was committed. That is a lie. You are a liar. Liar, liar, pants on fire. There's no doubt they are all quite upset. It is even considered a crime to lash out against an impressor with such an abstract effort. Translation, it's not a crime because it's not happened to Donald Trump. Song Weaver, dude, chill out. I don't like the part of the pavement was vandalized. I'm offended that it even has a star. Of course, I think it's near the one from the Victoria's Secret Angels, so he tells you what level it's at. How is that supposed to be? Who says? Due to. Due to I wish they came with a backhoe and ripped his whole damn square out. So there you have it. Uh, 
These are liberals on my own chat group. And they think that this is funny. These people are twisted in the head. One thing I said here, uh... You do realize that you are standing up for crime, or don't you? Well, it turns out Celtic Fairy Mom doesn't. Vandalism is crime, it could be Barbara Streisand star, and I'd still be angry. It's still a crime no matter what, whose star it is. And that's true. I can't stand Barbara Streisand. But a crime is a crime. And that's what this is. Unbelievable. These people are so twisted and sick in the head that they don't, they've lost their grip on reality. It's as simple as that. Somebody could set, somebody could do something horrible, you know, like setting fire to Trump Tower or something, and they would still think it was funny. They'd love it. Because they're sick in the head. Anything that causes harm to Trump, they're okay with. I just don't get it. I'm on Facts of Mars. I'm pissed off. This isn't funny no matter who it happens to. But uh, some are so sick in the head that they think it is funny. Thanks for watching.